This is about ignorance, hate, and discrimination. Chris Sanders with the Tennessee Equality Project is talking about a new bill introduced by State Representative Bruce Griffey. The bill would require Tennessee student athletes to participate in sports based on their sex at birth. It is insulting to trans youth. It is an attack on them. Their state government should be serving them and not seeking ways to marginalize them further. Sanders says this is becoming a pattern from lawmakers, introducing bills he calls discriminatory. This bill is a part of the 2020 slate of hate, what we would call the bills that attack the LGBTQ community. But Representative Griffey says this bill isn't designed to punish or discriminate. This is uh, an attempt to try to make it fair, try to base it on your birth certificate at birth, um, um, and so that everyone has a fair fair shot at, at uh, scholarships and a fair shot at winning. Griffey says there's a reason why we have boys and girls sports. If we're going to begin blurring the lines, it, we, we're really defeating the purpose of having fair competition to begin with. In the end, the lawmaker says it comes down to science and experience. We all know that traditionally males generally have bigger hearts, bigger upper body strength, um, and that can give them a genetic um, advantage when competing against women in a number of sports. If schools are caught willfully violating the guidelines under the bill, they could lose state funding, be disqualified, and forced to pay a $10,000 fine. The issue is animus and lack of understanding of the trans community. Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5.